Hello, and welcome to a very special edition of Stand By Your Van. I'm Paul Mark. I'm Josh Bradford. And we're from Silverstein. So without further ado, let's unveil the van. As you can see, pretty standard van, gas tank, <laughs> exhaust pipe. <laughs> um, in all seriousness, though, we, uh, our van couldn't be here today. But uh, so we're standing by our bandmate. And this is him. This is Bill. This is our Bill. Um, so I thought we'd start right at the top. It's the roof. It's where Bill uh, keeps most of his hair. <laughs> <laughs> Under a nice TZ suit hat. Yeah. Regulation. I mean, he's also keeping some hair here. He also keeps quite a bit on his back and his legs. It's the winter month, so it's uh, nice to keep warm with extra hair. Uh, yep, do you need that? I, I could use a pointer here. Uh, you'll notice we have these long arms and legs, quite the limbs on this specimen. Uh, they come in handy for reaching high up places on shelves and whatnot that I cannot personally not reach. Even, not even close. No, so that's, that comes in handy. Uh, sometimes it is detrimental. Uh, last night uh, it punched one of the strings off my guitar with a big swing like that, and I, I didn't know what to do. It's not something I would do myself, punch strings off guitars, but this is what happens living with a bill. Uh, I, don't, I don't know where to go with this. Here, take the pointer shot. We haven't cut him open, so we don't really know this for sure. But we have a theory that his brain is somewhere in this region. Um, based on sandwich consumption alone, the sheer time and effort that goes into these sandwiches, this is just not human behavior. So uh, we don't know, but I'm betting this general region. Bill's also a, a fine clothesman, dresses himself quite well. Um, again, a lot of time and effort goes into this, you can see. <laughs> Look at, we've got brand name stuff already. Um, down here, he just got, if I just remove our sheets here. Oh, I've broken my shark head. Um, he just bought these new socks. And they can stand up to shark bites too, so that's good. It's good on those. And those were uh, for his feet, on which he walks like any, anyone else, really. Most people do wear socks uh, in their shoes. Not all, but many do. Uh, but I've never seen anyone so excited about their socks as our Bill. Uh, he bought these Uniqlo socks and just freaked out about them to the point where he had to go back to the store and buy some more. I, I thought he was going to frame them. Yeah, good socks, I guess. For a display for everyone. Um, what else can we say about our, our uh, bandmate here? Um, Bill... He's big, so he plays the bigger one, the bass. It's got less strings, but it is physically like larger. Instrument. Um, like, it's really big. It's almost, well, you wouldn't want to really say how big it is. It's big, though. Um, I don't know. Ears? Yo, yeah, he uses that to listen to things. Yeah, and to keep his hat on his head. Mm. Right, ears it's helpful, I believe, wearing sunglasses as well. Yeah, he uses ears it for those. He loves sunglasses because he also has eyes. And the sun, ugh, bad for the eyes. Can be bright. Um, what do you feed a guy like this, you might be wondering. And the answer is lots of vegan meat and vegan cheese and vegan... Mm. That's really it. Well, you got to fuel them up with uh, the beers, too. Give them some beers. What kind of beers? Uh, all sorts. <laughs> <laughs> I, I've never... Uh, met a creature that enjoyed uh, beers as much as our Bill does. He uh, runs on beers. I don't know. This has been Silverstein with Stand By Your Van to remember. <laughs> See you at the show. We're going to ride Bill there. Come on, let's go. <laughs> this way? Yep. <laughs> 